Hey, it's Faye. Have you heard of 5kg pants? Minus 5kg pants from Chew? Apparently, minus 5kg jeans shed off about 11 pounds from your body. The illusion is supposed to make you look like you lost weight. Pretty sure if you shop on Yestel, you've come across these negative 5kg jeans. The Chew jeans. First of all, I hate jeans, but because the negative 5kg ones are supposed to make you look slimmer, thinner, blimmer, me and my hip dips, why not? Also, this top is from Yestel. Y'all seen this top, so it's Bras. Not only did I get a bunch of jeans, a skirt, and a short, I got minus 5kg shapewear. I'm gonna try these on at the end though because I think it's fair we try these jeans on our normal bodies without no like sucking it in. Some of us were wrong. Don't miss out. It has the official chew tag right here. We love that for us. And here's the official labeling the minus 5kg jeans. Jean. Just for reference, is this cricket? I know. Judging these jeans, they look fitable, wearable. It's not too wide leg enough to not be canceled by Gen Z. It has these little slits on the side. Yeah, that's how it looks like. So get your screenshot in for your reference. Okay, will my legs fit the leg holes? A little nervous. <laughs> Enlarge my ass. We please remind ourselves that a large in Asia is kind of like a medium hair. Check your measurements. And also, a lot of things were out of stock, anyways. If there wasn't XL, there was only large. So I grabbed the large. And if there wasn't large, I did not grab the medium. <gasps> you can do it. Okay, I'm gonna break a meal. So poofy down here. This belly, the circumference of my belly, is not allowing me to zip anything up right now. There's not enough fabric to go around. I can't, can't. We're just not gonna try to zip it up. But you might just need to shut off a little more. It kind of makes me look like I have a small little butt. Just a small little butt. Oh my god, I freaking zipped it. I just needed a break, okay? But I did it. We're here. We're feeling confident. Super comfy, feels snug on your belly. It feels like a slim snug. It doesn't outline my muffin top and my hip dips. Well, maybe it does, but I don't care. It looks nice to me. It's kind of witchery. A lot more flattering than normal jeans on me, especially in large. And I'm even surprised that this large zipped up because we know how that fiasco went with the Asian sizing in large. It's actually comfortable. I don't know, it just feels good. I think I'm more happy the fact that I was able to zip it because for a moment there, lost. I love that it's high-waisted. Pull it up, tuck it in, you know. Girl, listen, Linda, you know what I mean when I say tuck in the side. I don't know if skinny girls can relate. If you're like me, oh, you know, especially in the back, you're like pulling your bra down, going like this, going like this. I love how the slits are right at my ankles. However, I do think these jeans would be cuter if it was a little bit above the ankles. Your girl's only five feet tall, so let's not get selfish here. The chubs, the camel tail, whatever you want to call it, it's it's minimal. These jeans kind of quiet it down. I'm not like saying that it's camel toe free. It's enough to keep people looking, but not enough for them to stare. <laughs> Okay, so next are these shorts. They don't look promising, if I'm being honest. Not sure why I would pick this color. Screams. Look at my chubs. Look at it. Which side is my ass? You know? I guess I was brave when I put in this order. Also, notice that the band is not as stretchy. These are in the size large. Give me a second. Oh, girl. Oh, my low. Oh my god. Oh my god, I am so thick in the front. She was really blessed out there. They said not in the back. Let's give her something in the front to look at. Oh, zipper is small. It kind of eats your fingers a little. Okay, we got it. Kind of. It's the kind of zipper that I feel like if I breathe, it's gonna unzip real fast. So let's, uh, let's make this quick and painless. Okay, that's as far as we're gonna get, which is pretty good. Let me tuck in my fats. Holy bajis. Oh my god, look at this cheese. You know, honestly, it's my fault for having a thick down there. I just have a really fat, fat chubs. Not a fat ass. I'll save you the trauma. It's not flattering. <laughs> okay. 
can't see. Um, let's pretend that that was not outlined. I will still say no to these shorts. Absolutely not. Turn to the side. You can see the bulging of my tummy. If you're comfortable with that, please give me some of your confidence because I need to work on that. That's just how society trained me to look at my body to feel insecure about those things. This is how it looks like from the back. We are in the little prairie out here. It's a flat plain field. We out in the plains out here. I wish we were working on this, but we're not. I'm very attractive. I don't know. It kind of hurts pushing my underwear up there. The creasing here, here, the creasing's here, here. She said, magnify on those insecurities. These are the Hobbit jeans and I got this one in XL because they actually had the option. The unexpected fit. I know for sure. Oh, okay. There's, I can why am I doubting? Okay. So the Hobbit jeans have a stretching band. The bottoms love their wide leg. It has this rough cut here. A little bit distressing going on. Look at this. You know, oh, by the way, I don't know if you're supposed to keep this on. Such a staple of the branding. I don't know. Are you supposed to take it off? I guess the choice is yours. Price is right. Hmm. Hmm. This is extra large. Deep breath. Tuck your hair behind your ears. <laughs> Interesting. They say XL, but they feel smaller than the large I tried on. That's suspicious. All right. Okay, this is with it without a zip. Oh, got a little stinker back here. Here's a trick. Wrap this side around, the other side around. You fold it, you hold it. Nope. Okay, the zipper is just rough. It's not me, it's the zipper. It's stretchy, you know, see? Okay, we got it. it. Wasn't as bad. My pores exploding? Yes. I'm so sweaty. My crown is falling off. Okay, I'm not a big fan of stretching, I guess it's a design, <laughs> to kind of blend in that tummy line. I have. It starts from here. It spreads out like that. It's kind of old-fashioned, not trendy, but whatever. I do like that it gives an illusion to the eye. Corvette, Corvette. It creates this very like hourglass look because it's pulling everything in. The washout right in the center just feels very old-fashioned. Digging my crown off when I'm asking the crown to you. You tell me how it looks from the back. No, you don't. I can't control how I look from the back. With front. I don't know if it's the coloring of the jeans, but it doesn't make my my chubs stand out. Again, these will be super cute if they were above your ankles, but because I was blessed with less shin length, no legs, they come right at my ankles or under my ankles. I don't know. Comfortable. Hey there. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just pumping gas. It's right in my back. Might as well be my PE active jeans. <laughs> Okay, so the next pair of jeans are not chew, but they are also minus 5 kg jeans. Normal skinny jean. This is a size extra large and it looks a lot bigger than the chew one. It has the same like stretchy band. I don't like the color. I don't like the stripes. Not a big fan. Oh, this one is soft. Feels like warm. Oh, I'm good, I'm good. By the way, if you guys want to see me actually dress up these jeans, follow me on Instagram and TikTok. Especially on TikTok, I'm gonna try to do more comparison videos. You'll see a more realistic angle. Oh, see, this lit up easily, quick, no struggling. These jeans look really good. <laughs> Baggy on my legs, if you must. And yes, my height plays a role, so I get it. So yes, Gen Z's, come for me. Come for me, Snuffleck. I'm kidding. <laughs> It's too baggy on me. A lot more stretchy than the Chew one. It's a little baggy on my legs. Compared to the extra large I just tried, this is also extra large. Quality is not as sturdy. Not a huge fan of the stripes, but it works, it blends. These jeans are enough to like do some errands in, but not enough to be on the gram. You know what I mean? Like you see? <laughs> I like the flexibility. Okay, so the next pair of jeans are back to the two minus 5k jean ones. This is an extra large and these are the strut, I mean strut, strata, straight cut, wide leg, not a freaking skinny jean. So here we go. Mentally prepare ourselves. Ow! Oh. Don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. Well, that's definitely not gonna do it for us. Boop, boop, boop as my boyfriend would. <laughs> These are extra large. They are long on the bottom. They hang off the foot. <laughs> minus 5 kg pants is supposed to make you look like you minus 11 pounds off your body. Apparently this is a plus 5 kg pants. Makes you look like you've gained 11 pounds. I cannot, I will not, and I shall not. If you're gonna get an extra large, don't go for the straight cut one. This one has literally no stretch to it. That is my review. 
Next we have Choose Minus 5 KG Mini Skirt Volume 1, 2, 3. Okay, first of all, let's take this pants off. Ah, let's take my underwear down with it. Can y'all relate? Honestly, it's sad because these jeans are actually really good quality. Most likely we'll be giving it away. Do you want? Let me know in the DMs on Instagram. No stretch. Do I have hope? No, we shall see. Oh no! It's a skirt. I honestly don't like that. Didn't know it was a skirt. How much stretch to it? <sighs> Get that breath out. Oh no. There's a brick of caught in the front. Wiggle sniggle. Oh. Um. Look, we should be proud of ourselves, okay? We got through the short part. Zippity hippity boop. I don't want to break the butt. <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh my god. I think I just lost my large intestine. Oh man. Um, you can see my tongue. Oh my gosh. So the jeans create a friction when I walk the shorts underneath and it rubs my thighs together, my thigh fat. Because your girl don't have that gap between her thighs. I think I'm gonna cut it. Yo, my legs just grinding against each other. Holy crap, you're gonna start to fly up in here. <laughs> you can definitely tell it's tight on me. You can see the pouch and all, but honestly, it's not horrible, you know? I could do worse. I'm like leaning against my cabinet, so if this falls, we all do. This frames my muffin top as if she's ready to bake. Don't act like you don't like your chocolate chip banana bread muffin. That's us. Something extra to grab. Um, it's so tight though, so you can't really grab anything. Look. I feel like I'm duct taped. I'm gonna make it a goal. By summer, I'm gonna fit this skirt comfortably. Listen, Linda, by watching this video, I hope that you guys can relate to it. I see the reality and normality of the fact that we just don't fit clothes sometimes, and it's totally okay. You don't have to be ashamed. You don't have to hide it. It is fine. It's still a good day. Look at my tummy bulging out from here, above my skirt, from the side of my skirt. All normal. People who have a problem with it can suck a big one. Actually suck a small one. I do have one more pair of chew jeans and they're in black, but I figure wearing this minus 5 kg Hobbit jean in size large, I tried these XL earlier, I'm gonna wear a shapewear to see if it does anything. These are both from Chew and they are still the minus 5 kg shapewears. We're gonna try this one. As you can tell, this one looks like this. Cool beans. This is the minus 5 kg shaper underwear, or er, underwear. Ooh. I'm a liar. I'm I a liar. Okay, first of all, this is a tank top. <laughs> How are you gonna call yourself an underwear? Oh, shaper underwear. Okay, well. Cool beans, we're back here, so we're gonna put this one on, but this is actually quite interesting. You know what? I'm putting both of them on. Yep, making my way through this whole, yes, let's go, let's show them. We're stuck at the boobies. Feels like a oopsie. Oh, 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 oh. I'm giving my all. Oh, it smell. Maybe we'll put this on top of the girdle. Ooh, silky. It does suck you in, but it's not like suffocating. It doesn't even feel like it's sucking anything, eh? Ain't these jeans look really intimidating, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm actually not gonna layer the top shapewear on top of the girdle because that will create way too many layers and way too many <laughs> obstacles to go over. Okay, this jean is not promising. Ooh, there's too much. It won't button. Is it the girdle? I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, okay. No more. Yeah, this is good enough. Okay, all right, look at me wearing my large hair. I don't know if it's because it's a dark jean or not, but it does not give me any outline of my camo, my belly pouch, the lines, the creasings. I mean, it kind of does. But it has a flatter surface. Hello? She snatched. Do you see all the chubs popping out though? It's being harassed upward because of the girdle. It gives a little squishies. Squishies are out. It's cute. It feels good. It feels comfy. It feels very snug. It's creating really heavy breathing. Really snug, but they're still comfortable in a way. Like I can still do squats. I can still try to grow that ass. One year later, still trying. Let's do the sitting test. Oh! So when I sat down, I felt my baby kick. We tight, like me and this jean tight. Yeah, I... These jeans with the girdle on, flattering. Not Nine out of 10. Minus one point because of the comfort when you're sitting and when you're eating too. Girdle itself, really comfortable, really silky on the body. Doesn't feel like you're wearing it at all. The bottom shapewear, 10 out of 10. The top, I think this is more for when you're wearing a dress. I can't guarantee it'll be magic and witchcraft on your body, but um, it's nice. I don't think it's necessary. If you're gonna pick a shapewear, just go with the bottom one, the girdle. That's it. 
That is it for this minus 5 kg jeans haul from Chu. Make sure you like this video if you guys want to see more hauls from me, especially for my thickety sickities. Make sure you follow my TikTok at hey.it.thing. Until next time, I'm sending love. Bye!